Today, we're going to turn a dipole into a doublet. Wire everywhere. Hello there. Right, some high tech music. Two Echo Zero Tango Whiskey Golf Portable. Hi, I'm Tim. Two Echo Zero Tango Whiskey Golf, based in the south coast of England, in the county of West Sussex. Uh, thanks for joining the channel and thanks for looking at the video. It would be good to have you subscribe as well to see some more and some future stuff I'm going to be bringing out. So today, what are we going to do? Well, in a previous video, about a week or two ago, I made a shortened 40 metre dipole out of two uh, legs of 450 ohm ladder line, uh, both measuring just under 7 metres. So the overall length of the antenna is around 13 and a half metres or about 45 feet in length. And as you may recall, if you've seen the video before, it tuned at 7.14 megahertz and provided good coverage on 40 meters. Now what I've done, I've taken the coax down, I've reattached some 300 ohm ladder line, and I'm now trying to turn this antenna into a multiband antenna. And so far it's done really well. Uh, we get a tune no problem throughout all the HF bands, and we've worked stations on 40, as you'd expect, 20, 17, 15, and 10. But of course, the big test for me is to try to get some better coverage on 80 metres at home. In my old single wire, 44 foot doublet, it tuned on 80, but it wouldn't be, able, you know, the, uh, the tuner and the ballon wouldn't let me put more than 5 watts through before everything went haywire. Uh, it just wasn't working. It didn't radiate hardly anything. I'm looking to see whether this antenna, which of course is electrically longer, uh, being resonant at 40 metres, whether or not that works better on 80. So... Let's have a look at that, but initially, let's also have a look at how the uh, doublet looks and how it was constructed. Well, here is the antenna, uh, made out of two strips of 450 ohm ladder line, shorted together at the ends. And as you can see, if we go closer to the uh, central support pole of the inverted V, then instead of having coax, we now have 300 ohm uh, ribbon feed or ladder line, whatever you want to call it. And that's coming down the pole. And for me, because I've got a very convenient little shed right next to the central pole, I can run it around the back of the shed, as I'll so show you in a minute. There's the uh, 300 ohm going back up to the centre of the antenna there. And here it is, going down the back of the shed. Uh, needs a bit of a clear out, get rid of some of those cobwebs. <laughs> there it is. And it just goes along the guttering. And as we'll see in a minute, it goes down the other side. Here we are. And uh, it goes into a one-to-one -one current ballon with a very short piece of RG213 coax, about a metre long, into a tuner with coax back out of the rig. Well, the antenna worked well on 10, 15, 17, 20 and 40 as a doublet, but the aim now was to see whether I could use it on 80. And with that in mind, I joined the Work All Britain net on 3760 to see whether I could make any contacts around the UK. My overall goal is to have an antenna that works on 80 metres to around a 200 mile footprint. Let's see if I can make any contacts on the Work All Britain net. Tango Whiskey Golf, G1YSS Mobile, Tango Lima 66. Any copy over? Yeah, G1YFF from 2E0 TWG. The square is Sierra Uniform 90. Your report is 5 and 7, 57 QSL. Yeah, Mike Zero, November Mike India, you are 5 and 9, 5, 9, 59, and the square is Sierra Uniform 9, 0, QSL. Yeah, QSL, the 5 and 9, thank you very much, you came right up there. What's your name, please? Uh, it's Tim, Tango India Mike, Roger. Roger, Roger, Tim, thank you very much. Uh, Tim, Echo Zero, Tango Whiskey Golf, from Golf 7, Alpha, Boxcar, Mike, name is Phil. Yeah, two echo zero golf kilo golf. Good evening. You are five nine. Your report five nine. Sierra uniform nine zero. Roger. Great. Thanks very much. Uh, you're five nine. Romeo, India. Name is 
days. I'm in Tango Lima, 4-2, and you're 5 and 5 and 55. G0, Zero Tango Whiskey Golf, Tim. This is Golf Bravo 50 Whiskey Alpha Bravo in Sierra Kilo 43, named Tony. And you're 4x4, Tim. Four. Uh, the 20 Tango Whiskey uh, Sierra, Sierra 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 5 and 9 from G0BCK. Yeah, G0BCK's G's 2E0 Tango Whiskey Golf. You're 5 and 7, 57 Sierra Uniform 90, Rog. Yeah, two echo zero, Fox Mike November. Good evening again. You're five and four, five four from Sierra Uniform nine zero, Roger. All copy, November Yankee six zero. Thank you, my friend seventy three, and I'll hand it back to the chair. Thank you. So, did okay, didn't it? Made some contacts throughout the UK. Around 200 miles maximum. I think one was 280 miles up to County Durham. Signal reports were variable, but contact was made. I'm very happy. I was able to use 50 watts consistently, no problems. SWR was flat throughout 80 meters. And to be honest with you, I'm happy. Um, I may in the future try and make it a bit longer, that's the antenna. But for now, I'm going to keep it as it is because I don't want to injure some of the radiation patterns I may have on the higher HF bands. So I'm going to keep it as it is and see how it goes. Maybe you can try something similar too. Hope you enjoyed it. Don't forget to like, share, subscribe and join the fun. 2B0TWG wishing you 73 and the best of luck with your antenna experiments too. Bye bye.